Hey YouTube, this is a structural research center and we are going to answer a classical question of Abacus users. So this is the question, how to define tensile behavior of concrete in Abacus. In Abacus, you could define your model tensile behavior in this window. And after defining concrete damage plasticity in the tensile behavior tab you will put yield stress and cracking strain and finally you will find such a results tensile damage and compressive damage actually when you are defining concrete damage plasticity parameter in abacus you need to define tensile behavior. Most of researchers and designers ignore it or based on experience, they assume that is 10% of compressive strength. But if you want to simulate the accurate tensile behavior, you should use the relationship that the researchers have presented in this field. There are several <clears throat> relationships that many researchers have used or presented them, but here we show you the relationship that we have used repeatedly in Abacus and have reached the desired results. This relationship consists of two parts. The linear part is for the tensile strain which <clears throat> uh, they are less than crack strain and the other side we have exponential part for tensile strain which they are more than crack strain and in here of course you need to validate the m parameter And n is a parameter which ultimate strength depends on it in the plastic state. And finally, these are the other parameters you should use for the main relationship. And that's done. Now you have accurate tensile behavior of concrete. So you can visit some of the Abacus model which produce using this method in our website and get them. So find the below link and good luck.